Bob Costas back in Tampa and now we're privileged for a brief period of time and kind of a makeshift setup to talk with coach Bo Schembechler who's watching from his home in Ann Arbor. Coach how are you feeling. Fine Bob. Um, as long as we can continue to lead this game I feel real good. The first couple of times your team had the ball you tried some different things Taylor on the first series Brown on the second and didn't move until that second quarter. Well I think um, it's very difficult against the Alabama defense until you know what they're going to do. They change uh, from week to week and of course with a month's preparation um, they gave us a lot of different looks there early. How difficult is it for you to sit at home and watch as your team plays in this bowl game. This is no way to coach football. I don't ever want to do it again. How much influence have you had on the preparation for this game. How much is you and how much is Gary Mullen. I want to say right now regardless of the outcome of the game. The Michigan staff has done a great job. I've had practically no influence whatsoever on what they've done in preparation for the game. And uh, I think they've done a great job. You told me last night as we spoke on the phone that you plan to resume pretty close to your full schedule within about a month or so. Yes I'll um, I'll be back in uh, football. I'll see my doctor Monday and see if I can't talk him into a little more activity. I'll begin uh, recruiting in another week or so and uh, looking forward to spring football. But you won't be traveling you tell me uh, for a while you might recruit over the phone or whatever but you won't leave campus for a while right. I'm going to I'm going to have to do all my recruiting this year uh, here in Ann Arbor and I hope it ha doesn't have too much of a negative effect on uh, on our prospects. Uh, I'm sure it won't because um, as long as they know I'm going to be back to coach I don't think it'll hurt us that much. Coach thanks very much for your time. We all wish you well. Happy New Year and a speedy recovery. Happy New Year to you Bob and to all your listeners.